Hey everyone, welcome to my channel Chris Extreme. My name is Chris. And so in today's video I will be talking about and showing you the new software which I just received. It's 2019 8.3 and I got some extra features. So let's check it out together. This is my Model S um, 2018 model with 75D uh, pack, 75 kilowatt battery and the D with for dual motor. And uh, yeah, let's see what's new in this software. And we will go drive a little bit on autopilot as well, to see if any improvement uh, happens other than new functions and new features. So let's check it out. Let's go. Make sure to subscribe. Again, this is 2019 8.3. So looks like I got Sentry mode. Uh, I was waiting for this for so long. So really good I can catch people if they come close to the car <laughs> all right but we will test this out I really want to see how it works so but let's just go through it quickly so sentry mode basically uh, continuously monitors the car's surroundings while it's locked and parked when enabled the car automatically enters the standby state with its cameras and sensors remain powered to detect potential threats uh, threats and triggers an appropriate response um, state alert or alarm uh, to enable sentry mode go to controls safety and security and sentry mode um, it says that if a minimal threat is detected such as someone is leaning on the car sentry mode will switches to alert state displaying a message on the touch screen that uh, the cameras are recording if a major threat is detected such as someone breaking a window okay someone um, then it switches to alarm state in this state, the car alarm activates, audio system generates loud and unexpected sound. Um, the, message on the, um, the message on the touchscreen increases to maximum brightness and you will receive a notification on the mobile app. Okay, that's good. Though, I would love to be uh, notified if someone is also leaning on the car, you know? I don't want someone to lean on my car. I want to, I want to know it or at least I, wa I, wanna, I want to get a notification that you know, it, it, uh, when I get in the car on the screen or something. So that's, uh, I hope they, they will love that because I want to have that. All right, so to save the video clip captured in Sentry mode, you must inf insert a USB flash drive, but I already have that for the dash cam. But looks like there is an update to dash cam as well. It now records um, on the side cameras. Okay, and dog mode, basically keeping your um, air condition on. Let's see. Okay, yeah. There's a dog mode. Let's let's see this. Uh, let, I'm gonna try this out. I'm gonna get out of the car and let's see what happens. Okay. Looks like it works, but I can also be a dog. I don't need to be outside of the car, you know? See, now I'm a dog and I'm inside the car. That's so nice. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so this works and it's pretty good. I like it. Uh, now the only thing we're missing, we need to have a dog, but we will have soon a dog. So I think we're gonna get a husky soon, hopefully. All right, let's test out the other features. Let's go. So dog mode is working fine. I'm going to turn it off now because it's hot inside. Um, the heating was on. OK, let's try sentry mode, shall we? I think we should. I want to see how it works. OK, so sentry mode, we need to enable it in the settings. And go and see. So. There we are in uh, settings, safety and security, and sentry mode. There, this is eye icon, which is basically the same stuff. The, uh, if the battery level in the car drops uh, to below 20%, then sentry mode will turn off. So you need to, you know, you need to have your car charged to make sure that it's active. But you will get a notification on your phone anyhow if, if it turns off. So you know that you need to, you need to plug in your car. Uh, if you want sentry mode to be active again, so I'm gonna enable it now. Okay, sentry mode is active, and you shall see what happens.
I don't have the key with me, so. But I have my phone. Okay, it flashed the lights. And it's now recording, I think. Okay, so. I can see the screen is on with the eye. It's not there's no alarm though. Come on! I want the car to alert in this state. I mean it's recording, that's fine, so I might be able to see the person's face and stuff. I heard a noise, but I don't know what was it. It's not record. I mean, it's it's not. Uh, it's not. No alarm. But I'm trying to play with the autopilot cameras to get them enabled. But I mean, get the alarm enabled. Okay, what if I try to move the car? Ugh, this car is heavy, I can't move it. Okay, well, cameras are activated really soon. I mean, it was really quick. As soon as I came close to the car, it was recording. Now it's even recording. But I cannot get the alarm to go off. Why not? What do I need to do to get the Alarm to go off. I don't want to break the window, obviously, but... Let's see if there's any notification on my phone. There isn't. Hmm. You said sentry activated recording. Hmm. It should go off. This is a sound what would you know what you would get if someone tries to break the window in. So I'm really not sure why it's No. Nothing is happening. I mean not nothing, the camera is activating again. Yeah? Ah, uh, that's strange, you know? Okay, I cannot open the car. Okay, let me put this camera down and let's try. I'm gonna try it differently, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna try it one more time. Let's see. I want the car to alert if this happens. <laughs> it should... Okay, I don't know, I think I gave up. It is not alerting. It's in not, it's just in uh, recording mode. I cannot get the alarm to activate. It should go off, isn't it? Well, anyhow. Looks like the, at least the recording, it goes off perfectly, it works. 
but uh, but yeah, the alarm with the loud music and stuff, it's just not happening. It's not happening. I, I don't know what, what I would need to do to, because I'm not going to break the window. I think they should change the sensitivity for this to, uh, to a bit uh, higher. Looks like I cannot get the car to activate. I mean, I don't want to hurt the car so much. So. <laughs> Sorry, guys, but it looks like I cannot activate it. I just um, I'm not able to activate it. So let's test uh, autopilot now. A big turn here as well again. We're going with 80, 25, slowing down. Much, much more confident. <laughs> 